Hi everybody, review time. I was shopping at Trader Joe's this weekend with my mother and I saw this pizza. Love Trader Joe's, have had great, great luck with everything I've gotten from Trader Joe's so far. Everything's been high quality, reasonable price. This pizza was four seventy nine. I mean, it's a almost fifteen ounce pizza for four seventy nine. And look at this product of Italy. I so want this to be good. It actually it has to be good. It's a product of Italy. Um, margarita pizza is not my favorite type, but we'll see. It looks like it came out pretty good, so we'll see. Nutritional information, 320 calories for a third of a pie. I'll eat over half of it, so probably double that. Sodium, 840, pretty high. Um, I looked at the instructions. It says seven minutes. I went like eight and a half because I wanted it, but this is something I like. They actually stated in the instructions, if you want a crispy crust, bake an additional minute. That That's good. They're actually being honest with, with the instructions. Oh, by the way, all the frozen pizza companies should do this. I guess it's more money, more manufacturing cost. This pie is fully cooked and then frozen and shipped. So all we're really doing is heating it up. We're not cooking it from scratch. Usually you get a much crispier crust. You get like the, the burn marks on it. That's the way to go. All right, one negative right away, I'll tell you right now. This is a sacrilege. Microwave directions. Heat on high for 45 minutes in the microwave. Come on. Nothing that's imported from Italy should be microwaved. And frozen pizzas in general, like, should never be microwaved. Unless they have, like, that covering underneath it, like, um, that one kind has that makes it crispy. I can't recall the name of it. But, um, still... That's crazy. Microwave pizza, no good. All right. Here's the picture. Looks great. Here's what we got. Does not look great as the picture looked. It looks like in the picture all the cheese melded together. So it looks really like nice. I mean, this looks good too, but it's just, I don't know. It's not like the box. Oh, it's crispy. Oh, I should have fil filmed me cutting it, by the way. When I cut it, it was like... <sighs> Like the crisp right through it. It was nice. All right. Let's get a piece out. Let's see. Pretty good Pretty good undercarriage. I mean, it's got the marks on it. It's a little bit on the floppy side. I should have went another minute. Ah, so much for great instructions. Anyway, it looks good. I want this to be good. A lot, lot of moots. Let's try it out. Mmm. Nice crunchiness. Mmm. Sauce is nice too. Let me get a bite in the end. Oh yeah. Quality pizza. Mmm. Mmm. Delicious. The crust is perfect. Really tasty. Man. Sauce is good. The cheese is good. High-end pizza, four seventy nine. What a bargain! I'll absolutely get this again. I highly recommend this. I'd pay. I'd pay eight bucks for this easily. The Roberta's, Roberta's pizza is like twelve regular price. I, this should be like eight or nine dollars. They're like underselling this. Huge, huge pizza. Great score. This is going to be. I'm going. Let me take one more bite. I got to get an accurate reading on this guy. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. That's what I'm talking about. This pie is going 9.1. It's that good. You got to get this. It's a total bargain. Especially if you go like taste up price ratio. This bad boy is clearly worth it. That's it for today. If you enjoyed this video, please click like. Subscribe to my channel. I'll almost definitely be doing a dinner one tonight. All right, thanks, everybody. Have a good one.